I'm about to see my own apartment for the first time ever. <sighs> what the fuck? Good morning everyone, welcome back to my channel. Another day, another vlog. So thank God I have makeup on right now because if I did not, you would see how freaking tired I actually look. <laughs> it is my move-in day. It's my very own apartment for the first time ever, living alone, never lived alone before. But yeah, last night I was like so excited and also really nervous that I just couldn't go to sleep. I also was packing a lot of last minute stuff. <laughs> so I legit got like maybe four and a half hours of sleep. <sighs> I'm definitely feeling it this morning. I feel like I've been waiting for this day for so long. If you're new here, I was already living in New York City for college. I went to NYU, but I came back to my parents' place in New Jersey the past two weeks because your girl was homeless. And now we're moving back into the city. And yeah, it's gonna be a very busy day today. I have a lot of stuff. Ta-da! It doesn't look that bad. Yesterday, this whole thing looked like a sh show. Let there be light. So if you guys happen to be new here, which welcome, I'm so glad to have you here. This is actually the spare room in my parents' one bedroom apartment. This is actually a den, which is a room with no windows. So people usually use it as like storage or like an office. I lived here <laughs> for the entirety of COVID. My junior year of college, I remember like it was freaking yesterday. But yeah, I'm sure all of you have your own COVID stories. Mine was that I got kicked out of college because COVID. We all got kicked out. I'm not a bad student, okay? I didn't get kicked out. I graduated somehow. <laughs> I had to leave my dorms. I had to leave my friends. I was back living with my parents and I was living in the spare room and hold on. My legs are tired. <laughs> I'm very grateful that my parents were willing to take me in and let me live here. But yeah, to go from this den to my tiny crammed ass apartment in New York City after to getting my own place. Words cannot describe how blessed I feel. The real subscribers on this channel know we came from very humble beginnings. I'm excited to show you guys our new apartment, okay? It's ours. The movers just left and I'm gonna meet them there by Ubering. <laughs> I was originally supposed to go with them in their truck, but there was no space because I have too much stuff. I live in North Jersey, so it's literally like 20 minutes away from New York City without traffic. So yeah, it's not that bad of an Uber ride. I'm also sitting with my money plant. Actually, this is not mine. This is my old roommate Jenna's and she gave it to me. The only job she gave me was not to kill it, but it's already turning a little brown. So my goal for this new apartment is to <laughs> somehow aliven this poor plant. All right guys, I'm about to see my own apartment for the freaking first time ever. <laughs> I'm so excited. <gasps> oh my God, you guys. <sighs> June is here. I'm shaking right now. This is crazy. This is freaking crazy. I cannot believe this is mine. This closet is like the size of my old room. To a lot of you guys, this may seem like really small, this studio, but for me, this is huge compared to my other room. My other room was a literal closet. What do you it's think? Nice. It's nice. nice. I'm setting up the most important part of my apartment, my supplement drawer. June brought me Chinese food, much needed. I'm freaking exhausted from unpacking. So am I. You went to go take a nap. <laughs> you went to go take a nap and I was alone here unpacking. Good morning. 
morning, you guys. Ah! It is officially one day since I've moved in. And not gonna lie, it was kind of hard for me to fall asleep. I think it's because I'm not used to being in a place as nice as this. <laughs> I think my body was like in shock or something. I don't know. But yeah, waking up to this freaking gorgeous view. It still has not sunk in. I unpacked like literally all my stuff yesterday. I was like, I'm getting this done today. <laughs> I hate when there's like clutter and stuff around. But yeah, we are officially all moved in. I already feel like such an adult. Like I woke up and just vacuumed. I actually had a desire to vacuum. Like who am I? <laughs> but yeah, speaking of being an adult, I put all my new dishes, plates and stuff in the dishwasher to wash. It's clean now. So I get to take it out and put it into my cabinet. I have never been this excited to unload a dishwasher in my life. I want to show you guys how freaking cute my new plates are. I am in love with them. And these bowls, dude. How cute. I guess this is how you know when you're getting older, when things like bowls and plates excite you. Also, my new mugs. I'm just living out my Pinterest dreams right now. Tell me this doesn't seem like that girl type of cup, you know? She's grown now, she has wine glasses. I organized my cabinet. So the Tupperware is up there, and then I got my plates and my bowls, and then my glasses. Guys, are we loving this workout fit or what? This green color is beautiful. This feels buttery smooth. And it makes the booty look nice. This is actually from Whitney Simmons X Gymsharks collab. It actually just launched. So if you guys want, the workout details will be linked down below. Just made my little pre-workout drink. Cheers. Just in case you guys are wondering, my pre-workout is OxyShred non-stim in the flavor strawberry. I usually take regular stim version because that has all the caffeine, but it's actually later in the day now. So if I don't drink non-stim, I'm gonna be like wired for the rest of the day. Or if you love caffeine, regular OxyShred, gummy snake flavor, amazing. Actually, EHP is having a huge summer sale right now. So now's your time to stock up on your supplements and save your coin. And if you wanna save more money, you can use my code LENA10 for money off. Never feel pressure to use my code. You watching the video and being subscribed. If you're not subscribed already. What are you doing? <laughs> what are you doing? That's enough support for me. So I'm very grateful for you. This gym is hella nice. It's like nicer than I thought. It's about to become my second home. Today's leg day. Working on a weekend like usual. Way off in the deep end like usual. Niggas swear they passed us, they doing too much. Haven't done my taxes, I'm too turned up. Virgil got a paddock on my wrist going nuts. Niggas caught me slipping once, okay, so what? Someone hit the block up, I tell you if it was us. Man, a house in Rosewood, this shit too plush. Say my day's a number, but I keep waking up. Tell you see my text, baby, please say something. I'm at Whole Foods right now, picking up some food because I'm starving and I have zero groceries at my apartment. Other than my brother at my apartment. So we are celebrating. I don't think family counts. No, family doesn't count. We got our wine, we got our wine opener. I actually don't know how to use this. Okay, so you're gonna wanna. <laughs> Cause I literally never drink ever. Bruh. Oh, okay. We're getting somewhere. Okay, the arms are lifting up. This is yeah. business. <laughs> yes, we're getting somewhere. First of all, I've never seen anyone struggle this much <laughs> to open a wine bottle. We're definitely doing something wrong. Here we go. Yes! <laughs> So what do you think of the apartment? It's so cute. It's so modern, so chic. It feels so love, like loving in here. Aww.
just finished journaling. I honestly have not journaled in a while and it actually felt really good to journal. I'm just like reflecting and being thankful, you know? If you haven't journaled in a while, this is your sign to go journal. Really quickly before I go to bed, I just wanted to talk to you guys a little bit. I know that there's probably some new people here, but those of you who have been rocking with me for a while, you guys know that this is not usually my life and the fact that this is even a reality for me is because of you. Literally right before this, a month ago, I was living with three other roommates in a flex wall bedroom that was like probably 150 square feet. <laughs> so the fact that we came from that to this is just amazing and I'm just so, so grateful for each and every single one of you. Like I hope you know how much joy and pure happiness you bring to my life. This apartment is not, this is not even what makes me happy. It's genuinely you guys. You guys honestly keep me going. You guys keep me motivated and I love talking to you guys every single day in the comments. Check the comments. I try to reply to every single comment before I get all sappy and drakey and emotional on you. So I just want to thank you so 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 much from the bottom of my heart for supporting me because this is all because of you. I'm a 